the important thing is that the uh, uh, IT and the, uh, uh, now it's becoming a different industry. It's, it's more about uh, servicing your customers. You, those nerd programmers who are sitting late at night, that can, uh, is what more you have to face the customers. At the end, because IT, if you look into uh, any area, it's uh, for example, you know your downtime, you can assure the customer that systems is uh, this work karenge, they give the, this performance levels. Uh, so th this is very important. Uh, ki ye, so you develop your soft skills with the engineering skills as well. You, you understand how to uh, have a discussion with the customers, how to uh, understand the requirements, how to give them feedback. That's even the, uh, one of the, uh, the more critical areas. For example, when uh, the students and the trainees are there, they, they say that they are more oriented towards building a high-end solution to the customer with these things, that you can do it in 15 minutes. That's very important. Okay? Uh, you have to develop your soft skills with, with your hardcore engineering and technical IT skills. The other thing about, uh, when you talk about masters, uh, for example, for Pakistani industry, I think if you are doing four years engineering degree, because uh, then it, it's, it's more than enough, you can you can go into the market. A master is good, uh, but it's more toward, uh, towards R and D side. If you want to go into research area, maybe you are interested in teaching, then it's good for you. For for entering the industry, uh, most of our uh, IT trainees and I've seen the people in IT industry, they they are bachelors and they are performing well. They are at senior positions. Uh, but what you can do, for example, if you enter into the IT industry and after getting some experience, you can go for your, if you're interested in business process something, you can go for your MBA or that type of area. So that can add value to your soft skills and that. Uh, but for the hardcore technical skills, uh, bachelor's is enough for if you are getting into the industry or the corporate or the software engineering sector. Uh, just leaving the particular uh, R&D sector, which is the defense side in Pakistan. Sir, to what extent does uh, GPA matter and university matter? Job I don't know, but you that, that I need to know what I can yes, answer. But from from ID perspective, GP, yes, it matters. But when we are interviewing the person, we are not only really testing about the technical abilities, about the perception. What this gentleman is just saying right now, it's a team player, you know, Navi Kaha. Yes, totally agree. Now, you, you're going through the things, the HR policies, when you're hiring a person for any IT based company or any other job. They are not only really seeing your technical qualification, but your other skill sets. Your leadership qualities, your team player qualities, how you can involve yourself, how you can be a, a part of an organization in building up the things. In about the initial interview, I think you will never know a question to teach you what they are really looking forward to. After a simple example, they know. Maybe you will go to the industry and ask a question. Yes, you have extracurricular activities involved. We will say yes. What? Our team of football team was that. We have a captain now. Finish. From the captain, they have observed this kind of leadership qualities. Which are seen. I'm just quoting you one example. These are all the HR techniques which they fill in and give it to the other people from IT perspective, from any other jobs perspective. What is just these two gentlemen were saying? Just wanted to add on to these things. We touch on all these points when we're talking about. I'm going to say that GPs. Positions, yes, really matters, but at the end, this person really matters. If you can never do anything in this person, you can never do anything, never achieve anything. Except to do a job, it's totally different, but it's just to do a hustle. That's totally two different, two different aspects. So I think I completely agree with you. Uh, okay. Please correct me if I'm wrong, but Apple was founded by a college dropout. That's what I'm saying. I'm not saying now. Unix to only uh, the BSD, BSD, Unix to the college Unix to something. Unix to something. BSD Unix, which is the core, father of everything. Yeah. Developed by whom? University students. Fresh graduates. They're not even graduate. Yeah. Today, the world is going on. Seventy percent internet. 
ऑपरेटिंग सिस्टम बेस्ड ऑन यूनिक्स प्लेटफॉर्म्स विकिलीक का बता वो इस विकिलीक से सर सो यू सो सो यू प्लेटफॉर्म नेवर व्हाट आई एम सेइंग एट द एंड ऑफ द डे इट्स यू पीपल इट्स यू पीपल व्हिच रियली मैटर उसमें सबसे बड़ी चीज जो मैं यहां हूं इन पाकिस्तान आई रियली सी व्हिच इज द लैक ऑफ टाइम मैनेजमेंट एंड स्टूडेंट्स सॉरी टू से दैट वी वेस्ट अ लॉट ऑफ टाइम लॉट ऑफ टाइम I have never calculated in within 24 hours how much time your creativity is there as a student. That will, uh, I think, so that if you start thinking about things, uh, these things, the guidance will start now. You get all your answers. You will not be sitting away around or asking these questions to start looking into those things. So I think that's that kind of in sync with your earlier, very early on, your Mari Baat with you about uh, have the right. Vision have the focus, that's what it's and saying. that's what those gentlemen had. We have we have time for just two more questions. One over here. Well, sir, as you said earlier, the basic issue that arises when graduates apply for jobs is the lack of focus. You know, they don't know their destination, which way they're going. But sir, there are some students who do know where they're going. I, for example, I know that I want to go for an artificial intelligence. But sir, that is something uh, that it's not like software development or networking. So you know, find very few people actually working on it. I like it. So, good. sir, at least you've got a focus, you've got a vision in your mind. Yes. So, sir, due to lack of uh, guidance, maybe when I apply for a job, there will be certain drawbacks in me in terms of presentation or selling myself. So, sir, could you give me a chance? Definitely, but you need to show your skill sets a little bit, basic skill sets. Basic skill sets means you should know how to make a presentation. If you do not know how to make a presentation, then I am not going to help you out. But during your interview session, you should be confident that you know how to make a presentation. You should have done these presentations or doing the things during your four-year degree program. Yes, sir. But it's very different. And, and most importantly, to add on, your confidence. Your confidence will really matter at the end of the day. Let me tell you one thing. I will say one thing. Getting the job is about selling yourself. Nothing else. If you're not able to sell yourself, you cannot get any job in the market. You need to prepare yourself. How you going to sell yourself? Sell yourself. As Dr. Sahmeer said, that it's not about a city, country. It's a global. So you are in competition globally. And if you cannot sell yourself globally, then IT is not the right. Thank you. So to actually add on, to actually add on uh, the first. Stealth virus ever was created by two Pakistani brothers in '86. Yeah. 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 First stealth virus, Pakistani two brothers. Yeah. 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 I don't one thing. When they have created that, and they even do not know themselves what they are yes. doing. Yes. When they have been announced yeah. to the market, then they came to know what they are doing. But they are thinking. <laughs> thinking. Main thing is that they are thinking about positive. They have to do something. They have to do something. That's what the intention should be. Okay, just adding to that, for example, artificial intelligence, uh, uh, that's really good that you got your focus. Uh, now, what you need to work on, uh, what are the companies who are working on artificial intelligence, what are the happy you can apply. Uh, so, that's really important. Then, uh, you should know some basics about your artificial intelligence. Uh, for example, what are artificial intelligence, just the definitions of it. No one will ask you to just write the algorithm completely there and just build something in the interview process. Uh, so, you should know basically the definition of the things. Uh, just uh, adding a few lines on the GPA thing. Uh, I totally agree, for example, if uh, in the IT industry, they are, are all, uh, for example, it's, it's by the people who are not graduate themselves, for example, MBA, Steve Jobs, they are all they go down to the university with the bachelor, and then they, they are going to make the fortune. Uh, that's but uh, for example, uh, if I talk about the corporate sector, the GPA, uh, for example, if you are 3.8 and you want to change 3.8 GPA, it's not, uh, it's, it's good, but uh, you don't have to have 3.8 or 3.7 GPA. But if you are just, on, you remain on probation for, uh, for a few semesters, then it shows uh, lack of seriousness on your part. You should, uh, that seems that you are a moody person, you, you focus on time and then you lose focus. So that you, uh, you should uh, maintain something consistent. For example, I tell people maybe around three, uh, something good, for example, and then they show that you have some consistency in your career. And, uh, even though, for example, if you have a decent GPA, but there's a lot of fluctuations, then again it shows, for example, one semester you say, okay, I will do 
anything in the next semester, you don't even get classes. Uh, so there should be some consistency around it. Uh, and I think uh, uh, being university students and uh, by passing through all the admission test, it's not difficult to just remain about 2.8, 2.9 or 3. You can just keep that level uh, for your career. If you are getting more than that's good, definitely good. But uh, at least you should maintain some bare minimum. For, you said you're for yourself, just looking at the job industry, for example, if I know, uh, if you're talking about Ango or anything, they, they set the cutoff mark at 3. Uh, uh, for example, ICI is uh, at 3, but uh, they, they set up for, for example, for certain universities, they won't go at 2.8. So you can do the R&D. For example, that's something which the HR departments, because they have to do something to filter out. And that's their first filter before even the testing. Uh, so that's for, for uh, your sake that you, you should uh, maintain some consistency. And that can help you in other areas too. Just, uh, maybe you're pushing yourself in other area and you, uh, you, you are enhancing your capabilities that you can just maintain uh, in academics and you can perform, uh, for example, if you're in a job, then you, you, you can just motivate yourself, okay, I, I have done that in academics. If I'm not performing well, I can do that next year. Uh, एडिशन <laughs> और आसान जवान में इन शॉर्ट मैं बोलूं कि मैं अपनी कंपनी के लिए या किसी भी ऑर्गेनाइजेशन के लिए वैल्यूएबल हूं कि मैं जितना मेरा मेरी सैलरी है सैलरी व्हिच आई एम गेटिंग फ्रॉम द कंपनी एंड दैट शुड बी रिटर्न इन टर्म्स ऑफ के कोई भी वैल्यू एडिशन इन टर्म्स ऑफ वेरी वैल्यू एडिशन नंबर 1 नंबर 2 ये कि आप ऑल ऑफ यू आर मोर कॉन्शियस अबाउट द जॉब मैं इसमें थोड़ा सा मतलब हर किसी की अपनी अप्रोच होती है मेरी अप्रोच ये आई एम सेलिंग माय सर्विसेज एज अ बिजनेसमैन इन सिटिंग इन अ शॉप और इन अ ऑफिस कोई भी अपन वो क्या कर रहा था अपनी प्रोडक्ट को सेल कर रहा होता है एंड योर प्रोडक्ट इज बेसिकली योर स्किल कि जितनी अच्छी रिफाइंड स्किल्स यू गाइस हैव इट इतना ही अच्छे वे में आप उसे सेल कर पाओगे फॉर एग्जांपल अगर मैं बात करूं कि ऑटो इंडस्ट्री की तो यू प्रेफर टू गो विद अ टोयोटा लोकल मैन्युफैक्चरर में जाएंगे फॉर एग्जांपल मैं बात करूं अगर रेफ्रिजरेटर होम अप्लायंसेस में रैप में यू प्रेफर टू गो विद अ डॉ बिकॉज़ डॉलेंस because a way real product hai uske english ki stability same with those with you guys as well aap apne skill set itna enhance karo is stability se improve karo because mein uh, matlab aap ko approach kar rahe ho so it's very easy to matlab ye wo do cheeze hain mai ye kahunga zarur hai that fresh aap logo ko ki apne zehn mein rakho jab bhi stuff in kar rahe ho industry mein to value addition ka sochu ki kis tarike se mai value add kar sakta hu वैल्यू एडिशन मतलब आप इस तरह की चीज नंबर टू कि आप ये चीज ना सोचो कि यार मुझे जॉब ढूंढनी है बेसिकली आप उस जॉब में अपनी स्किल्स को सेल कर रहे हो यार यू आर बिजनेस एज वेल सो व्हाई यू आर थिंकिंग दैट यू हैव टू फाइंड अ जॉब एंड ऑलवेज ऑपरेटिंग ऑफ ऑनिंग वो बॉसेस रूल्स नहीं भाई आप अपना बिजनेस कर रहे हो आप अपनी स्किल्स को सेट कर रहे हो स्किल्स जैसे नहीं होते उस दिन कह देते हैं सामने वेरी सिंपल मतलब एक बड़ा स्ट्रेट रूल बन गया है इस वक्त सारी इंडस्ट्री में क्रॉस साइड है Just, just wanted to add one thing. Just think of it. After this, sort of how many of you have ever thought of starting their own business after completing the graduation? Good. I just want to talk about this. Okay. Just adding to that, we are. Uh, so it's important that you uh, you are. Uh, uh, she said actually that you are selling yourself. So. It's, important that you can say to the interviewer what you can add to that company and saying okay this is a good company and i want to join it that's something which why the interviewer want to uh, to to hire you actually you have to say that otherwise why you want to join that company what you can give to that company uh, in, uh, as he was saying uh, it was uh, really important that what the uh, in any business in the, the software industry in any sector when they are hiring person that, that person is adding value to the company and that But the salary and the benefits that person is getting, the value addition is definitely more. Otherwise, the company cannot run in long time. So, if you are doing basic research, for example, uh, that company operates in this area, they are doing this. You can form a very general, brief and general idea that what you can give to that company and what if you will be, uh, if you can, uh, if you are at that position in the company, what how the company can benefit from you. Uh, so, because. Uh, It's selling yourself. It's not the otherwise actually that uh, uh, if you are in the interview process. 
definitely recruitment drives and these type of activities are there when the company is selling to you actually the book about their brand name. But when you are interviewing you are selling yourself. So you just let the interviewer know that how you can benefit that company. So I the first sale that any one of us ever made when, was when we were children or in Zada Jayakya men. So the parents will think, ah, yeah, it is easy thing, it is the Zada Jayakya. So that's the first sale that happens, and that continues on to the rest of the life. One last question over here. How are you? Uh, I want to ask one thing that uh, I'm going with a two mindset. Uh, one is that I should do my MS program for years, or most of the time. And uh, other thing is that uh, I should uh, go for a job and uh, do it in Middle East or somewhere else. So for that, uh, should I have experience uh, in the Middle East to get a job or I, I should go for an MS and uh, then I should go for a job because uh, one of my uncles is in USA and he is he's, he's an electrical engineer and he has done his MS program from, uh, from uh, USA and he, he, has, he has a job in uh, origin. So he said to me that if you are uh, if you are fresh graduate and first you do it uh, first you do your MS uh, from here and then you go, uh, go for a job. So what's your opinion about it? Okay. Uh, um, it's, for example, if you are going, for example, if you are going from Pakistan to any other market, uh, maybe I, I, I will generalize it. Maybe Middle East is one market which is definitely near to us. There is an uh, Asian Pacific market, Malaysia, Singapore, are booming economies, and then you go to Europe and uh, maybe USA. Uh, when they are hiring from Pakistan or these countries, they are looking for a specific skill set. The un unfortunately, the unemployment level in these countries is high because of recession for two three years. So it's very difficult for the people from here to, uh, to go into Middle East or to European markets without uh, having the, 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 those tools set actually with them and that come with, it, with some experience at least. So it's, uh, if you just target the market after just graduation, if you just apply to Middle East, it will be very difficult because they have their own people, they have their own graduates, they, they have to be, to whom they have to give jobs. In the European market, for example, they have cut the immigration levels because their unemployment level is rising. Uh, the people are not happy with their governments uh, because they are their voters. So they have to first serve them and then the other people from the other markets. Uh, so it's, it's uh, good that you get your job first in Pakistan, get some experience, and then as Dr. I said, the world is open to you because it's, it's again the global market. But you have to get your tool set with you. Uh, rather than just jumping into, for example, you graduate and you say, okay, I'm going to Dubai to get a job. Uh, but what you, have, you have seen what happened to Dubai last year. Uh, now they are coming back again, but uh, they were in a real problem last year. So now it's, it's not like that, that uh, uh, the grass is greener on the other side. Uh, and if you, for example, I can give examples from Facebook, because uh, I, I, so ICI is a global company which operates in 70 countries. If you equate uh, the cost of living, the salary is approximately equal across the globe with some variations because if you are in UK, you are getting in pounds, the cost of living is very high. So approximately your net savings, if you are, if you maintain that living standard, if you are not uh, living with five, six people in one room, your saving level is approximately the same uh, for the jobs because it's a global economy. The, the companies it, it actually equate the salaries across the globe. Because the information is available uh, on that. You can go to anything. For example, I recommend the site ID Job Watch. You can stick the average service for any of the position ID position, uh, developers, project manager, SAP consultant. You can check the average salary level there. Uh, so, and any company can see that and they equate the equitable salary in all the countries according to the cost of living. So, first uh, get some experience, uh, then you can uh, try it anywhere. And, uh, of course, there is actually a uh, uh, skill is always required, and uh, this this industry is booming at a rapid rate. So very very well said. In fact, um, yesterday I heard that um, India's IT export alone, not talking India. I'm sorry, I love Pakistan a little bit too much. India's IT export is 48 billion dollars per year. Pakistan is not that far behind. Pakistan last that I remember to report. Sorry. 16.4. That's, that's still 48. Uh, sorry, 16.4 billion dollars, and each billion has a thousand million in it. 
That's a total expose. Uh, uh, after converting yes, into you know oh, mass rupees, that's another yes, one. Yes, you're right. Yeah. That's not, a total expose. It's not the IT. IT is wrong. But IT is still in the millions. It's still in the millions. It's still in the millions. I I'd be fine with one million dollars. <laughs> I'd be fine with one million dollars. I'd get a nice car and drive it around. It's not worth it. I, I drive it around off-roading, but the point is, made everyone happy. Localization, <laughs> IT especially. Um, last year we had an email from Google as well, many high-level people over there, the gentleman who was running YouTube as well. So, globalization, everything is being centered on across the board. To end things, we just, I, I just like uh, some comments as in what um, commitment do you have towards the students from this session, what the main learning was. But before we go in there and someone over there loves playing poker, uh, gambling is bad for you, you lose all your money. But um, we have, CIO Pakistan also does mentor nashtas. There are more focused sessions uh, with the industry, with the uh, gentlemen, these gentlemen, if they commit to it, and other gentlemen as well from that very level. Mentor nashtas, more focused sessions, more um, collaboration, more understanding, better understanding. Uh, each one of these is two hours mentors with their organization. You can write in to us if you want to take part in these at cc at ciopakistan.com. Once again, that's cc at ciopakistan.com. And we will send you the details if you want to get them right into us. We will give you the details. The drop uh, feedback forms correct here. They must probably have your details, so we will be getting back to you. The main purpose behind campus conversations at the end of the day is to bridge that gap. Because students, we, we know from this session, we know from this session that the students we are gathering, there is that gap. All other statistics aside, you feel there is that gap, the, they feel that, yeah, there possibly is that gap. We've all been students as well. Just to end things, sir, what commitments and what, um, you know, what, what's your main takeaway from these sessions? I will, I will be available to give you my guidance. And whatever guidance you needed, whatever help or uh, anything you needed from my side, I will be available to groom your career, finance. As a, in fact, man, not from as a, as a CIO uh, Pakistan platform ke perspective, se bhi, as a SSUT alumni, I love to do this because abhi tak ye hai, Alhamdulillah, bahut achhe aap log ja rahe ho, bahut achhe aap log ka market pe bhi hai. The most important thing, how quickly, how efficiently you can get yourself in into the market. और एट लास्ट में आप लोगों को एक चीज और ऐड करूंगा कि इस वक्त आप लोगों के पास जो फैसिलिटीज इस वक्त यूनिवर्सिटी में अवेलेबल हैं बहुत एफिशिएंटली बहुत अच्छे तरीके से आप यूटिलाइज कर सकते हो एज एआईएस आप टू वर्ड आई रिमेंबर राइट नाउ आई डोंट नो के सोशियत वाज द फर्स्ट यूनिवर्सिटी हु इज गॉट द एचपी यूनिक्स सिस्टम्स एचपी यूएक्स जो कि सिर्फ यूएस में एक हाई और सिमुलेशन के लिए वहां पे ऑटो इंडस्ट्री या कोई भी इंडस्ट्री यूज करते हैं सिस्को एकेडमी यू हैव गॉट अ सिस्को एकेडमी एज वेल यू हैव गॉट अ माइक्रोसॉफ्ट गाइस एज वेल सो द मोस्ट इंपोर्टेंट थिंग हाउ यू गेट इन वर्क ओके सबसे इंपोर्टेंट चीज आप लोगों के लिए मतलब आई वी प्राउड टू से दैट के सीएम वाज द फर्स्ट इंडस्ट्री टू इंट्रोड्यूस लाइनक्स इनटू द माइन पाकिस्तान सो सीएम वाज द फर्स्ट इंडस्ट्री सो यू गाइस हैव ऑल दोस थिंग्स द ओनली थिंग यू नीड टू नीड द गाइडेंस फ्रॉम आवर साइड Yes, as a Umar, uh, I will be available to guide you, and uh, जो भी आप schedule करेंगे आप भी okay. In this last few words, it's uh, definitely very nice to be able to meet you because this is the first time I get to see you in university, and uh, basically, university basically I was mostly in Lahore and the north side for the company I was transferring at last year. Uh, it's, it's really nice, and uh, you people are developing skill set, and uh, you have that motivation level, you can grow. And uh, I, uh, there's no doubt in my mind that someday I will see you in uh, the, the, the good positions and lot of companies because you are the people who actually get into the companies. And even I have that anxiety when I was at your age and at your time because where we go. Uh, so it's really uh, really nice to meet you. And as I said earlier, uh, I got the formal request from the uh, university. Uh, we will arrange a two-three hour session uh, in the uh, in, in my company. I will definitely push push HR to make that arrangements. So you can come and uh, meet more people there uh, for what they are doing uh, in the sector and uh, learn more about it. Uh, and I definitely thank CIO Pakistan because it's, it's, a, it's a very good initiative that they are bridging that gap. And uh, even at that time when we were, we were in university, we felt that that's a yeah, gap. Uh, thank you all and just uh, work on your skill set. You are developing, you have a lot of academies here like Cisco Academy and Phoenix System. 
And with that, uh, just develop the other side of it, the soft skills, which is uh, gaining popularity now, right there, which is important to be in this industry. Thank you. Pleasure for you, my first time, at University. Face-to-face uh, -face interactions. So during my last experience, most of the people that have worked are the same graduates. I don't know if you can see that. Whether they are the software programmer or technical people or the manager, or they are the same things. Now, the commitment which I really need to do, which I've already announced in the beginning, I'll be sending, inshallah, very soon. We have just formalizing the things to the university. Recommended at least 10 people, out of which we select 4 people or 5 people. So I didn't say that, but cannot do the things. Select those people, give them an internship, and after the internship, complete, internship completion satisfaction, we'll hire another trainee team. And after that, we'll be training them for a year, and if they are good, they'll be based in Pakistan and all over the parts. Or in any other companies, requirements will be there. So we will be doing on a regular basis, year to year. That is the program which we're just really working on from our head office and all our management team is working on those things and I'm looking forward to see towards Pakistan, not from, as I said, we need to cater all over Pakistan, not only in this university. I hope you people do understand. But you need to prepare yourself. My message to you people, please prepare yourself. It's a competitive market, you cannot need to prepare yourself and sit and relax. It is Jobi Miljaga Karling. Means you are not heading towards anything. If you do not have goals in your life, you cannot achieve anything. A train shall be here, a high jazz will be a bus shall be here. So, we destinations can be found. Do you people know your destinations? Can we go to the Those destinations to the point where, yes, you will be facing a lot of difficulties, I understand. Like, this is one of the things. What is the market? What is the market? What are the trends right now? You should be doing a lot of those trends. You people are the luckiest one right now. When we people have started our career, we have got no internet access. We have libraries back to the table, magazines spent the hour, and then we have to spend the hour, and we have to spend the hour, and contacting our people, and we have to spend the hour, 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 and we as compared to us, when we, we had was the thing, I have my thesis to elaborate back up after the Bara Bara I have completed my thesis 12 hours while sitting in elaborate. Any of you, one back to the library in Bara Bara Copy paste, am I right? Copy paste is the one which is coming along? Copy paste or cut paste? Okay, do the cut paste, but at least my message. Most of the time, we pass research ke liye aate, thesis ke log aate, sab aata thesis ke please check it out and give us the guide. You know the mistakes, cut paste, padha nahi. I ask the questions, so I get the copy kya. Copy kya tha, wow. The reason I'm saying all these things, with all these things, do you think you will get a right job in the market? You're going for an interview with thesis and fire. And the panel asks you, this is not the correct way. You cannot explain your thesis. Do you expect me to have the job offer? Do you start to know what you are doing? Do you come to us with your body? At least, what are you doing? Copy paste card, okay, you've got that facility. Read it. You can make a diagram of your office to pay your party and you'll be copy paste card. You should not be there. Okay? So this is enough. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. So the art of copy pasting is something that it's, it's, it's not just and here I'm actually packing up Pakistan sincerely and so saying it as well that it's an art in itself and whoever has mastered that art is well not really copy pasting at all because then they're understanding what they're copy pasting. That, that's, that's, very, that's very useful. Yaya sir had something to say and please sir. We are coming to the end of this session. I want to give you कि हमेशा अंदर के नकल के लिए भी अंदर की जरूरत है। तो जब भी सीएम भी कीजिए पता कि अंदर कुछ दबा। ऐसा हम लोग दबाना कम करते हैं और बता दें कि पेज नंबर सो। जब हम लोग भी छोटे थे तो उस जमाने में नकल की इतनी आसानी नहीं थी। तो हम लोग कातुस बनाए करते थे। जब तक जवाब रखा जाता था। मगर ये भी याद रखना पड़ता था कि सवाल का जवाब किस जेब कौन से जेब में 